Right, okay, so we're getting to the end of this theory part of, of um, electronics where we've got a full and complete circuit. And I have already kind of asked you to do this, but the responses weren't great. And I know that the more times I ask you to do it, the better you'll get at it. Um, and we've been back and recovered some stuff from early on. So what I'm going to ask you to do um, in this exercise again today is to explain operation of the circuits. But I'm going to go back through and have a look at some stuff. And I've, you know, I've kind of given you a criteria. I've given you a list of things that you need to do. Yeah, essentially, I want you to tick off as you're going. Okay, so let's get a look at what I'm asking you to do. So we've got these two circuits here, um, and I'm giving you a description of what the circuits for, and then the two complete circuits. And I'm asking you to fully explain the operation of these two circuits. You should explain clearly. So in your explanation. And this is all text, you know, I'm expecting a kind of a wee sketch of the, the circuit and then a wall of text. How the input sensor works. Um, what does that look like? That's the stuff that we spoke about really recently. Um, that was the, the most recent one. That was when I was talking about this stuff. So we had done this stuff in school before the lockdown. And then I've asked you to do it again in this. So recognise what kind of sensor it is first of all. And then start talking your way through the sensor. Explaining what V out does in response to whatever it's sensing. Yeah, so that's the part about explaining how the sensor works. Um, when and how the transistor saturates. So again, if we go back in this, at one point in the past we've talked about um, what a transistor's for, what it does. <clears throat> Where is it? Right, so that was this bit here. So I had introduced the concept of transistors here, even given other examples of how to explain the operation of these circuits. So that was me talking about that. There's the introduction to transistors down here. Um, and again, all these videos are titled, so you can go back and watch these other videos. Um, so you can see it's that saturation voltage is really important and the word saturation for when it's switched all the way on. So all that stuff's in, in there as well. Um, and then we've got um, when and how the output device comes on. So that's just relating this to when this guy switches. Because when this guy switches, this guy switches, this guy comes on. You should mention each component. So like this guy's got a really specific job. You should be able to tell me what it is, what it's for. This guy's got a really particular job. You should be able to tell me what it's for. This guy's got a really particular job. You should be able to tell me what that is. Um, so this guy's got a really particular job. You should be able to tell me what that is. Um, obviously, so does, so does this guy. This guy's got a job. This guy's got a job and this guy's got a job. But those three are the kind of obvious things. That guy's there to sense temperature. That guy's there to act as a switch. And that guy's there to create sound. You should mention those three things. But you should also mention the other four that I pointed at two seconds ago. Um, you should make sure everything's fully named. <coughs> and explain the function of every component. Yeah, so... Um, that's it. That's what I want you to do. And, you know, always make sure that you've got a... When you've got a context like this, make sure you relate it to the context. I would expect to see things like the word frost and low temperature in there, maybe even greenhouse mentioned, as you're working your way through your explanation. And the same down here in the safe. You know, the idea that if somebody opens a safe door, what happens? And why does it happen? Right, okay, so a little bit repetitive, but this is probably the last time I'm going to put this kind of stuff up. I'm going to move on to the maths content after this, but I want you to give this a right good shot because this comes up every year in the exam. Right. All the best.